Hello everyone and welcome back to day 27 of Stardew Valley And today I think it's someone's birthday Yes, it's Emily's birthday So let's get her a pizza as well I guess if I can get enough money for that Since pizza is everyone's universal love I think I might just have enough money if I sell the beans but I'm not entirely sure so we'll see and let's say good morning to our chickies and our doggos first before we go into town and I guess I don't really have a lot planned for today except saying hi to everyone and Maybe just collecting a bit of wood or a bit of stone so we can um, try to get towards our goal of upgrading our house or getting a barn, one of them. I mean, I'll need to do both eventually, but yeah. Let's give them some food and let's say hi to our doggo that's still hiding up here. Let's see if I can reach... Yeah, I can reach the water thing. Well, good morning, Snoochie. Let's fill the bucket. And let's go to town. And hopefully we'll find a bit of things that I might be able to sell for a bit of money. Because otherwise, uh, I guess I'll have to give her something else for her birthday because I do want to give her something maybe I'll give her a bit of coral would she like that? I don't know I, I really don't know what Emily likes unfortunately let's see if we can catch Shane first is he... oh he is not here because it's Saturday whoa hmm, nothing in the trash nothing in this one Let's talk to our boy Alex. My arms are really sore, but that's the sign of progress for a guy like me. I must have done a thousand push-ups yesterday. Well, good job on bragging about that, my dude. I mean, no, nobody is going to believe you. Trust me. Hello, let's sell those beans. Hmm, no, I don't think I have enough pizza. Ooh, that's unfortunate. But let's talk to Abigail now that we're here anyway. Hey, good morning. The fresh mountain air is nice on a day like this. I wonder if the frogs will make an appearance soon. Yes, yeah, same, I love frogs. Alright, let's... Maybe I should quickly check what Emily likes or should I just go in blind and give her a piece of coral and hope that it's fine I mean I can always do that I guess sorry for that didn't uh, mean to torture you with Skype sounds that weren't yours hmm I just remembered that I was meaning to do something but I forgot this happens to me all the time yeah same I sometimes forgot what I'm going to do just when I walk in or out of a room and that's pretty annoying. But yeah. Ooh, is it? No, not the relic. Of course it isn't. It's just some clay, like always. Mm. Let's see. Yes, there is a piece of coral. Two even. And a shell. Maybe she'll like the clam better? Hmm, I don't know. I'm, I'm just going to try to give her the coral for her birthday. Maybe she'll like it. I mean, I can always try, right? Love is a trial and error process. Whoa, why is everyone gathering here suddenly? Let's try and talk to everyone. I'm feeling an urge to go shopping. Ugh, I wish there was a mall here. Hmm. Unfortunately, this is such a small town. You 
can't avoid meeting everyone. I wonder what it's like to live in the city. You smell like grass. Yes, thank you very much. Grass, yes. <laughs> That's coming back soon. I hope he brings me some toys. Yes, I hope he brings you back some toys too. And that your dad is safe. What? I didn't hear you. I'm busy thinking about something. What do you want? Well, that's a bit rude. Let's see if Emily is home. Maybe? I don't think so. Oh, wait, she is. Hey. Happy birthday. Oh, a birthday gift? Thank you. Well, at least she doesn't hate it. I like making my own clothes, but it's not easy to get clothes. And it's such a long trip to the city. Hmm. Well, let's see how many hearts we have now. One. Well, that's better than no hearts at all, right? Let's see, who do I need to talk to? Leah and Elliot, I guess. Oh, and there is Shane. I'm renting my room for Marnie at a really good price. It's small, but I can't complain. Nice, my dude. Oh, hey, let's talk to Marnie as well while we're here. Hey, Marnie. Have you been to that strange tower west of my house? Unfortunately, yes. One time I heard this terrible, otherworldly noise coming from there. I would avoid that place if I were you. Alright, will do. I mean, I, I think I'm going there anyway just to say hi to the wizard since I don't really have anything better to do except for saying hi to the fisherman. If the local fishing scene got a bit more lively, I might expand the shop stock. Mm, nice, I guess, although I'm not really that interested in fishing, I guess. But yeah. Alright, let's quickly make our way to the wizard's tower so we can say hi to him. Cool, cool, that was a very quick trip. Hello, Mr. Wizard, what kind of weird dialogue do you have for us today? Beware, you are standing above a potent magical field. I built my hut right here on purpose, you know. Well, thank you very much for your wise words. Words. I'll just um, go, go, yeah, I'm, I'm going. I'm just going to chop this non-magic tree to get some non-magic wood for my non-magic house without a magic circle or whatever it is. Without a magic anything, I think. Hmm, yeah, I don't really have anything planned for today, I guess. I mean, I could go to the mines, but uh, I don't really feel like walking all the way there, so I guess I'm going to the beach, fish a bit, and then wait for Elliot to come out of his hut so I can say hi to him still. I think that sounds like a plan, because I really haven't talked to him yet, I think. Did I just miss some worms? No. Good. Oh, hey, what up, Elliot? Hadn't expected you to be here yet. Alright, no fishing then, huh? You probably wouldn't like it inside my cabin. It's dark and full of spiders. Alright, nope, goodbye. No, but... I... I dislike spiders, but I'm over the phase where I'm like, Oh, please kill it with fire. I'm currently at the... Place a uh, glass on top of them and then try to capture them, I guess, and put them outside face because that's just a little bit nicer to them. Everyone seems a little happier on the weekends, don't you think? I'm on the job seven days a week though. Well, that's tough, buddy. Is it just me or does Abigail have an unhealthy interest in doom and gloom? I mean, what, what's unhealthy? Maybe I'm just too old to understand. Yeah, maybe it's just hip with the kids to be into doom and gloom. Hello, mister. 
The weekend is no different than any other time for me. That's how it is when you're retired. Alright. I mean, yeah, I think it'd be like that, I guess. When I was in between studies and... I had a lot of days that were basically the same and... It was quite boring, so... Yeah. Make sure your boots are clean before you go stomping around in my house. Well, I... I I'm not in your house. What? Um... Hmm, I... Wh what? Why are you mad? It's annoying to clean a mess. You should know that by now. But we are outside. Uh, I used to love looking at the clouds, but I have trouble seeing them these days. My eyes just don't work as well as they used to. Oh, That's too bad. Let's see if we can talk to Pierre, I guess? Hey buddy. If you find any milk produce, I'll take it off your hands for a reasonable price. Nice. Alright, I think that I can kinda leave it like at this for today. I don't know if I need to... Oh, hi too. Hello. Um, if I need to bring in some shells for the community center. Although I can actually just quickly... Check maybe. Hmm. Is there something in the fishing bundle? Huh? Yes, a clam. Yeah, I can bring the clam to the community center, I guess. At least one thing uh, that I've done today that's not uh, just walking around and talking. Ah, uh, yes, the clam. Here you go. One more thing delivered. Alright. Cool, then I think I've done everything that I wanted to do today. Because I said I wanted to chop a tree? Well, I did. I chopped one tree. One not so very big tree. I mean, if I kept on chopping one tree a day, then I would have like 170 pieces of wood in only 10 days. So. That, that's a fair amount of wood, isn't it? Probably not, but one day I'll get there. Maybe. Cool, let's put this stuff away. And sell the piece of coral. And then I think that I can actually call it a day. Since there isn't really anything left that I want to do for today. Um, let's check the calendar to see if there's anything going on tomorrow. No, it's just the last day of spring, I guess. Alright, then let's check the weather for tomorrow. It's going to be... rainy. Alright, maybe I'll just make tomorrow a mining day. Yeah, that sounds cool. Alright, thank you very much for watching this episode of Stardew Valley. I hope you enjoyed it, and I hope you had a good day today, and yeah, I wish you all good night.